Hi guys, sorry about me looking like death. Um, I just worked a, well, I'll get into it and hold on a second. I want it to make it more straight. Not like, okay. I'm pretty sure you guys don't mind. But hi guys, it's Leanne here and today on my channel, I'm doing a catching up video. I think I tried filming some stuff here and there. Um, never really worked out. And if I'm looking away, it's just because I'm thinking so hard. But um, to start off, I think it was the end of November, like end of November, early December. I, oh, it was right after Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. So it was like that Monday or Tuesday, I believe, because I was at the, or yeah, I was at the scene that day, I think, at Publix, because keep in mind, I still work to Publix. And peep the new nails. <laughs> um, yeah, so I was working at Publix and I had just walked into the break room to clock in because everyone there knew that I loved, I like loved just clocking in right away now that I wasn't like a minor anymore, which if you don't know what a minor, like the ages, it's, you're a mini minor under four or under 16. And then when you're 16, you're 16 to 18, you're a minor. So ever since I became a or a regular like adult, I just started clocking in early because I just hated just getting there early and then having to sit in there for like 15 minutes. So I pretty much just would always clock in while I was walking into the break room to do so. And I had gotten a text from the place that I am now working at. And she was like, cause I had gone there like, I don't know, like middle of September when I had gone on that um, trip to the Keys, um, Alan Murata. And I had um, that Friday before we had left. Sorry, my voice is like weird. <clears throat> I, I don't know what's wrong with me today, but I ended up going there and saying, hey, like, do you guys have an internship or like a job that you guys like, you know, like, are you guys hiring basically is what I practically said. She was like, no, but you can write down your contact info and whenever, you know, we are hiring, then we can, um, like, we'll, you know, like, we'll think about you. So, two to, like, I don't know, three months later, I had, again, gotten that text, and she practically said, hey, like, if you're still up for the, um, the internship, you know, we can set up a time to meet and go over a few things. So, we did. We met that next Friday, I believe. So it was like, it, it was either that Friday or that next Friday, I can't remember, but it was that Friday. So we had met, um, fast forward, we had met. I just noticed over there that my mom got beef jerky and we were literally talking about beef jerky the other day, the other day meaning last night. So I thought that was kind of funny, but off topic but pretty much we I had met her early morning it was around like 10 ish and basically we were just talking about um what I was interested in versus what they were you know like they were as a company and they do the remodeling portion so they do 
demo work, they do all of their remodeling, and then they stop at the, you know, like the redesigning the home. So they pretty much get everything done. So tiling, um, like any kind of flooring, um, like any shower work, they do all the, the bathroom work, you know, they do any, like all the kitchen stuff. Um, you know, they do lighting and stuff like, like that. Um, so uh, we had talked about that and I was like, oh, I just, you know, got certified in the design portion. So in the decorating portion rather. Um, and, but I had said that I was open to all options considering I'm still new and open to these things, sorry. I've been putting makeup on, not helping. And then I haven't been washing my face. Let's be honest, girls. Do we ever wash our face? I do. I do when I shower. Um, again, I get off topic a lot. That's why my videos are like 80 minutes long sometimes. Okay, that's pushing it. But like my videos are long because I talk a lot. But so we had negotiated pricing, you know, like my pay and stuff and she was like the next two weeks um because she traveled um she was traveling for the holidays so yeah um so that that two weeks she was like we had gotten the days that I wasn't working at Publix or days that I was starting later and I would work there. I loved it the first day. And um, I was pretty much shadowing her up until the last day that I had shadowed or I was there for the two weeks. And then that Friday, I think she had done, she had to go get something done, oh, a, a, like a rapid test before she was traveling that next day. So, um, I had a list of things to do. I had to do a, um, just bring something from one system to another, which was pretty easy. When I say system, I mean from Builder Trend to QuickBooks. If you know what that is, you know what it is. If you don't, look it up. But I, I did that. I, uh, polished um the cabinets so I kind of just cleaned them up and then whatever needed to be um you know refit or like not refixed but um reordered because it's damaged I wrote that down other than that um and then I did I think I needed another thing in QuickBooks. I can't remember what that thing was. Oh no, I had to get a file and then do that estimate um, portion, which was pretty easy. And then I had to put that in to QuickBooks. And then I, uh, what else? Oh, and then I organized the back. I love organizing if you don't already know. Um, so yeah, I really love it. I just had my first official week. I just finished it today and cause today is Friday. If you didn't already see by the beginning of the video. Um, yeah, I loved it. It's, it's a lot different and I'm still getting used to it. But I think the only, the biggest difference I would say, I mean, the biggest difference is going from standing all day to practically sitting all day is one of the biggest things I'm not like sitting all day because I'm like up and down all day considering but like at Publix I would literally stand all day you know I would bag or I would cashier or whenever I was up at customer service I was up at customer service I think the hardest thing and this is gonna be very um very I guess weird or off topic or not like off topic but like different 
to have an adjustment to, but the phone calls, the phone calls. I'm not hating on the phone calls, but like at Publix, like people would call, they'd be so demanding and like, you know, like they tell you about what the heck happened. Here, they, I feel like majority of the clients or customers, whatever you want to call them, they expect you to know what you're, or what they're talking about. And like, since I came in the middle of preparing for their season, which there's, I, I there's kind of two different seasons. There's one like office season where a lot of people come in to the showroom and they pick out all their tiles and they do like lots of like sending the contract and stuff, all of that, you know, jazz. And then there's the building portion, you know, the, the labor work for all of that, which um, I do not do any of, but I really love it. Um, it's a lot different. And I think, like I said, the phone calls are gonna be the hardest to get down. I think I had a very good phone call day today. The, um, the beginning of the week, I would have a hard time, like, when I answer the phone and like they're like, and I say, hi, this is, or hi, or no, I would say blah, blah, the name of my place, Leanne speaking, how may I help you today? And then um, they would say nothing. I'd be like freaking scared out of my mind. Just because, sorry, like my eyes look like, like I'm freaking about to kill you. I don't mean that, it's just, the ugly lighting and it's like a dark outside um so yes i also want to update on a lot of other things school's going very good i just turned in my um unit my final unit for well my final for it's more of like just like a regular assessments like assessments meaning assignments assignments and then leading and then it kind of just like fills you in I don't know excuse me if that makes any sense but um and then I just have I'm gonna do that I think it's intro to it's pretty much like an intro to um not retail give me a minute I know what that word is <laughs> real estate so it's practically like an intro to real estate um little unit and then I turn that in and then once I get graded for that I'll be done and graduated for the course and then I just have a professional organizing one and then I have a small little um a virtual you know like a you know, for, I think it's virtual design, I believe, which I got that one free for buying the, prof uh, the professional organizing, um, which is pretty cool. And then I don't know if I talked about this at all in any of my videos, but I do have a, um, I do have a business. It's called, um, Flawless Design & Co., I'll have the link to it down below. Um, I just want to let you guys know if you, you guys can browse on my website, but I am only taking people from Florida, um, preferably in my area, my, the Southwest area, um, Southwest Florida. So yeah, which is like Lee County and stuff. But, yeah, so I'm only taking people from there. But I hope one day to have it bigger and better. I just wanted to let you guys know. Um, I really enjoy doing what I'm doing. And I do hope one day that I can, you know, bring my business out into other states. So, yeah. With that being said, I just wanted to say I really love you guys. I'm sorry I haven't been posting. 
I had started working a lot, and plus it started getting really busy by the time I had stopped. I don't remember the last video, but and plus I've been having no motivation. But um, comment down some videos, and if you guys don't, that means you like all my videos. I'm going to try to post more talking videos like this because I love talking to y'all. Um, I think my next video is going to be um, something like related, you know, like a morning routine or something. I don't know, but I love you guys and I'll shut up now. Baby, so